bought it at a yard sale. The two older people were getting married, and the new wife said that this was her husband's favorite, but it didn't go with all of her furniture. So I bought it for $12. It's an oil painting on canvas, unframed. There's a French artist named Theodore Jericho. But Jericho is one of the leading artists of the French Romantic movement, as it's called. It coincided with the Napoleonic Wars at the turn of the century in France. This is a charging Napoleonic cavalryman, and the original painting was done around 1812, and it was exhibited at the Salon in Paris. Now, I think your painting could be as new as 1970. 1980. It's really done with pretty meticulous detail, but the style of it, the look of it, is very much indicative of a more modern painting. Many of them are actually done, believe it or not, on assembly lines, for want of a better description, where they're done very quickly, very faithfully, and by artists who we don't know, but who are academically trained and who are actually very technically gifted. You know, the way that the horse is painted, the way that the cavalryman is painted, uh, even the details in the background, it's actually, there's, there's a certain amount of optical fidelity. But compared to the original, you would see differences in the details. Then if we look at the back of the painting, we'll flip it over here. This is a wood stretcher that serves as a support for the canvas, but you'll see that the canvas is relatively modern. A painting that would have been painted around 1812 would have a different look. The linen would have a darker look, it would be more aged looking. Sometimes we'll have a modern painting that people who are perhaps not above board will spray paint the back to make it look old. A question arises sometimes with paintings like this. Was this created for the purpose of deceiving? Did they paint this in order to fool somebody into thinking that it was, in this case, a Jericho? And my answer is no. I think that somebody made this as a very decorative copy. It was really done as sort of an homage to Jericho. So, as a decorative copy, modern copy, I think it's something that would probably be at an auction, maybe a hundred dollars, maybe a couple hundred dollars. It's a beautiful painting. Yeah. I love it. Yeah. Well, I can see why.